let me get a proper look at the three of you. It's such a rare treat having everyone in the void. It's like a little staff party. And like any good party, there's more than a few trash rooms. And I am sensing a lot of intense energy. Of course, it's not a party, is it? It's work and none of you are where you are supposed to be. Madam, I... I only Excuse wanted me, to... I'm still talking. You left our meeting in quite a huff. Listen, I get it. Sometimes emotions run a little hot and you need to take a minute to compose yourself. We can't always control our anger, but we can control what we do with it. But you didn't. You didn't control it. You stormed out and started fighting with the staff. You've been picking on him for too long, and now you've crossed a line. You're frustrated and taking it out on both of them and the guest. We can't have you stomping around killing the guests. I had no idea you would... I said... Don't interrupt me. There, that's better. Plenty of light in the lobby, plenty of blood in the lobby too, huh? Is that my blood? That is my blood. Ooh. Oh, it's so interesting the way it flows out of me and gushes. I can feel it trickle out of my skull. It tickles and aches. I can see why the guests are always screaming. I know normally the blood flow should have stopped by now, but I don't know. It looks kind of fetching on me, don't you think? Hmm? Hmm? Kind of messes with the hair, but it really adds something to the dress. And it's so warm, like a blanket fresh from the dryer, only wet and smelly. <sighs> it's a shame the guests don't really get to appreciate the experience, not like we do. But honestly, what could they experience in forms like these, these blobs of jelly that can barely look in one direction at a time. I can't seem to hear anything. And just moving around is taking a lot of effort. Give a girl a chance. It's kind of fun, though, using my nerves to jolt my meat into action. Oh, it's harder to think down here, though, isn't it? I just have to think my thoughts one at a time. Oof. I nearly have to stop thinking just to say one thought. Phew. No wonder you threw such a tizzy fit. It must be very frustrating for you. All of you. But you're the only one freaking out, Mr. Man. Stomping around the endlessness, dragging everyone away from their jobs. Look at this boy. Look how upset he is. You okay? Yeah, you're okay. You put up a good fight, though, didn't you? Yes, you did. I don't want you making a mess like that all the time, but good job, kid. Now, why don't you go grab a mop and try to get some of my blood up best you can? Atta boy! He's a good boy, but you were right. I have to say you were right. No leadership qualities. Uh, not unfair. But he lacks confidence. That's the real problem. It can get in the way of his job performance, at least with the guests. His skills in building the room? No. Well, you just got a first-hand lesson in that, didn't you? <laughs> yeah, there's a steely interior there. You underestimate him, I think. You're too emotional and impulsive. Don't try and deny it. You two are cut from the same cloth for sure. You wind each other up, and who pays the price? Hmm? Me! And my pretty blue dress. And my new skull. Which you broke. He's been doing this lately, hasn't he, dear? Has he? It's so hard to keep it all straight now that's stuffed into this squishy little brain. Come here. Take my hand. It's okay. How are you? You doing okay? It was a rough night. I know you hate when things don't go how you planned. Yeah. I know, it's a lot to take in right now. We'll get these boys straightened out and ready to go in no time, right? Right? Hmm. 
okay. She still needs a moment to adjust. It's okay, you know, when things don't go as planned, you've got to learn to be more flexible. You can't carry the whole hotel on your back alone. Clearly. Oh, I don't mean to blame you, dear, but... Oof. If you could see the mess the boys made in that other lobby, it's a nightmare in there. <laughs> well, a different kind of nightmare than it should be. Okay, everyone, listen up. Here's what we're going to do. This disharmony not working for me. The infighting is starting to bleed over onto the guests, and I don't just mean this gushing wound in my head. Okay, okay, let's do it this way. Let's just do one and see how it goes. We're already set up here, so let's just go get tonight's reservation card, please. But, but the guest is... Go get it right now. Always arguing. It's always can't, can't, can't with you three. I know he's the vocal one, but you know what I'm talking about. You need to change the water in that bucket, Bug. You're just spreading the blood around at this point. Go ahead. It's okay. <laughs> now that it's just us girls, I want to let you know you're really killing it. No pun intended. <laughs> oh, I kill myself. I may be tough on you, but that's only because I know what you're capable of. 